Hey everyone and welcome to another Airbrush Asylum video. You can see the background has changed because we are at Morwell Art and Framing here in Morwell, um, obviously. And um, we are just about to go and check out how the students are doing. Uh, they're taking part in our introductory airbrush course. It's a one day class so we're out here being hosted by these guys to teach. So let's go inside, take a look at the shop and see what the students are up to. So really nice shop they've got here. All different art supplies, as you can see, they also do framing. So all custom picture framing. So I'm like a kid in a candy store here. This is incredible. Lots of different paints and brushes and different art materials for sale. Some art spectrum products. Windsor and Newton, so very nice. Great selection of paint and products. Some pencils over there. Got brushes and canvases. So pretty cool place to teach. And we've got the class running upstairs at the moment. So let's go upstairs and take a look at what they're working on at the moment. They're doing special effects so it's a great space plenty of room and just nice to be in a different environment running in one of our classes so this is a beginners class so most people have never airbrushed before Lee's doing an amazing job, there's nothing on the page. <laughs> <laughs> She's excused yeah. since she owns this place. <laughs> so they've done all their basic training earlier on. Now they're doing some spattering and building up to create the granite effect, which I just demoed for them. Pan across. Sounds like Faye knows what she's doing. So she's just using the spatter tool. You might have to angle that down that's a little bit like that. Spat. Yep. And that'll help you to, and then pull back. Yeah, see how you're getting spatters now? Yeah. Yep. Like yep. 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 Just let go of that trigger. There you go. Ah. Got it? Yep, yep. Tyler's doing amazing. Good work. I've asked them to build up a nice uneven texture so that we get a nice effect with the granite. Cool. I'll show you as well with the spatter tool once you've done your background. How are you guys going with your spatter tools? Um, trying. Yep. <laughs> Everyone's watching the video going, it's not a spatter tool, it's a peg. But they don't know. Yeah, great. Excellent. So nice view from above here too, got some artwork, this is Lee's artwork, she's done this with oils, so a bit of incredible work here, and they've got like a little makeshift gallery up here too.
looking good, Lee. Let's have a look, see what how you guys are going. Awesome, so you're up to black. Yep, oops. Nice. Just cleaning out your guns. Yep. Look at that. Pros. Pros at cleaning. Okay. <laughs> And a few times. Uh, the other <laughs> <laughs> I mainly just went around the eye socket, the top oh, yeah. of the noggin, some of the teeth. Yeah. Thank you. Top of the noggin. Top of the noggin. Starting with your black. Starting with my black. Nice. Oh, back with the. <laughs> yeah, loves the it. Cotton bud. <laughs> Good work. Next one. You're up to the white, are you, Anne? Yes. Yeah, Determined nice. to finish it. <laughs> That's good. Yours has got pretty good contrast anyway, so, worst case, even if you. You'd only have to do little smidgens of black if you had to. Yeah. It's pretty um. That's good. Pretty good. So remember, with the white, just let it build up. Oh, okay. So, so do a bit and go back. Yeah, you might have to just let it dry up a little bit. And, uh, oh, So I hope you enjoyed that video and you found it helpful. If you like our content, feel free to be part of our community. Hit subscribe, tap on that bell icon and that will notify you every time we put out new content. Until next time, go grab that airbrush and do some amazing artwork and we will see you again very, very soon. Bye for now.